Good morning. Thank you for joining me. And this is Floss Tube Season 2, Episode 13. And this week, well, I did, uh, where is it? 6,350 stitches. I did good. I did really good, I think. But, um, and I worked on five whips. For those of you that don't know, Mm. Floss tube is where I talk about my cross stitching or other crafts. Um, today is all about cross stitching. I did not do any sewing of any kind. I've been slowly rearranging my craft room. So, let's get to it. So, on Monday, I worked on Baba Yaga. This is where I was. And this is what I got done, which, because I already had a thousand stitches in, I only needed 1,200 and have my whip go board done for this one. So, that one is done. And that was on my Halloween board, whip go board. So, this one is up for a little bit. Then, uh, there was a couple rainy days. So, I worked on Oh, yeah. The river. My modern folk embroidery. Oh, um, Baba Yaga's by Autumn Lane Stitchery. And this is where I was. And this is where I got, I did 200 stitches all in all this week on it. Two rainy days. But I betcha there's going to be a lot more. Because spring has, it, it will, is trying to arrive. I know officially spring has started. But the weather does not always cooperate. <laughs> Then, I worked on my flower garden. Yeah, Fairy Flower Garden Medallia by Chatelaine. This is what it will look like and where I was. Fiber Arts, Amy, and I forget that one, I'm sorry. Um, they're doing Chatelaine Wednesdays, and I'm joining in. Anybody can just post, there's a uh, tag on Instagram, Chatelaine Wednesday. <laughs> but this is my progress so far. Thing is, I had to frog a lot of this and then go back and fix it. But I'm loving how it's turning out. So this Wednesday, I will be working on it again. I'm trying for 500 stitches for each week that I do work on it. Then I also worked on a Bella Filipina Maiden how do we say that? <laughs> this is where I was. And I think I made some good progress on her. I have her on Aurora by B Stitched Me. 18 count. But yeah. I was happy with that. 
I got quite a bit done on her. She is going to be gorgeous. If I remember right, she was my birthday start for last year. So. Eh. Okay. Of course, something fell out. Sorry. Sure. Yeah. There. Trying to keep these organized as I go. But the maiden, I got, okay, let's see, 315. Oh God. I got 2,350 stitches in all done on her, which is really good. More than I thought I would. Then, for my Whipco board, number 15, I needed to work on something by Thread Geeks. I picked Sometimes, which this is what Sometimes will look like, and where I was. there now this is the first page right all this is 310 then it starts changing different colors because I got the rainbow background well I noticed right here starts the dragon so <laughs> after working all the way down here I decided the next day I was just going to work across and start doing the dragon but I got 2,200 stitches in, so I was happy with that. And that one is on 18 count eight, uh, cream Ada, just plain old Ada. But it's going up for a little bit until I need it again. Okay, so that's all my whips. Not bad. Now, for this coming week, for Whip Go, I still need to work on Horrific Halloween. I cannot find it. I have been rearranging my craft room, and now I cannot find that one whip. I found everything else. Just not that one. So that one might have to wait a little bit. Then for letter of the month, the maiden was one letter and then the other one is sailing. So this week I need to work on sailing. And sailing is this pattern right here. From Crazy for cross stitch, July 2002 edition. This week, I have to get this done. I have to. I just need a thousand stitches in it. But that's all I got done so far. And this is on a piece of fabric from Fortnite Fabrics. And I cannot remember the name. Do I have it written down in here? No, I do not. Oh, well. <laughs> I don't remember the name. But I will be working on that one. For magical stitches, there's two prompts. I need 500 for each one. A whip that could be poison or could contain poison. And a whip with the sun. I've decided I'm going to work on my oldest whip because I did not get to last week and I am missing it. And that is along the forest path. This is what it will look like. And this is where I'm at now. So, I am hoping to finish this page soon. If not this week, then next week. I don't know. 
I don't know. But I will be working on it. And that's just on 18 count Ada white. <laughs> then, because I want to finish this one. I want to finish this one so I can do the, uh, the beautiful fox garden sampler, year in the woods. I want to start that. I need a large project or a medium project. Well, Gwen, and this is Gwen, was a medium, but because I've doubled it, she's now large. So, if I get her done, I can finish. I mean, I can start. So, I don't know how much I just got her to do in the rest of the grass here. So, this week, I would love to finish her. And that's it. If I find horrific Halloween, then I will start working on it, too. But I really, this shirt. I really do not know where I put it. <laughs> I have no clue. And it's going to drive me batty until I find it. I'm not feeling good this morning. But I did do my exercising. And I did a little bit of cleaning already. Here. And... I'm about to start stitching because I'm hurting. The weather keeps flip-flopping and that's aggravating my arthritis bad. So I'm gonna be sitting a lot today. I think today I'm going to go ahead and work on along the forest path. I've missed it and get the magical stitches prompts out of the way. Then I'm going to do sailing. And then the rest of the week, well, Wednesday, I will work on my chatelaine. And then the rest of the week, I'm going to do Gwen. I want to get her finished. I would love to start a year in the woods. And it's anybody doing it all on one piece because I am thinking about putting it all in one piece. And yeah, I don't know. I don't know. We'll find out once I start it. <laughs> because that's how it goes. I got more doctors this week. And I'm tired of going to the doctor. Every week I'm having one or two appointments and it drains me because I have to leave the house and I've got social anxiety and it hurts to walk. And then the stress of going to the doctor because I absolutely hate doctors. I hate it. <laughs> I'm ready not to have any appointments. And the next two weeks, I've still got appointments. But then I'm done for about three weeks. I think there's three weeks I don't have any appointments and I'm like, yes! <sighs> don't get sick, people. <laughs> Take care of yourself. But okay, that's it for today. I've got to find horrific Halloween. I do not know where I put it at all. <laughs> at all. And I had finally started posting on, on my Instagram again. I get really bad about forgetting about it. I do not post any of sometimes because you can't tell what it is. You know, it, you, you can't tell really. So why post there? But I will this week and hopefully 
I will get a finish. So I'm going to go so I can start stitching. And I hope everyone has a blessed day. And as you can see, the sun is coming. <laughs> and it's about to really wash me out, see? <laughs> so I hope everyone has a blessed day. And I'll see you next week.